Hey everyone, David C. Anderson here coming at you from the Knife Center. And today we're looking at the Signature Series Enrique Pena Pena Song Butterfly Knife. Let's check them out. So these knives are the mid-tech version of Pena's full-on customs and they're 100% American made. They come in at about half the price of the custom versions, but the fit, finish, and attention to detail is unassailable. All the final assembly is performed by Pena himself to provide great hand-tuned flipping action. So if you've been craving one of Enrique's custom valleys but can't swing the payment, these are going to be right up your alley. The delta in quality between the two is very narrow, and you really aren't giving up much by owning a signature series Pena song. Overall, these knives are on the larger side compared to most ballet songs. They've got a nice full grip with enough weight to carry momentum through very fluid motions. And the smoothness of the action is addictive thanks to caged bearings here in the pivot that eliminate almost any resistance. The frame itself is titanium and it's been drilled out for both weight savings and extra traction. You can get them with a flat titanium finished or anodized green, blue, or bronze, and the anode versions even sport a light stonewashed finish. There are also versions with micarta inlays over the titanium frame, and these are actually a hair lighter than the drilled titanium versions. The green micarta is a nice option, as is the natural micarta, which almost looks like a nice slab of wood. This creates a really cool vibe that you don't see too often on butterfly knives, which tend to go for a more high-tech aesthetic most of the time. The micarta is great for a smoother texture and a cleaner look, but the tie versions will definitely provide more grip if that's what you're after. The latch itself on the end of the handles are very strong, and there's virtually no chance of the handles coming apart accidentally. There are tie backspacers on the ends of each handle, and these provide a nice place to pinch when disengaging the latch. And of course, it latches up nice and tight when the handles are open too, snapping into place with a strong detent. For those of you who use your ballet songs as actual cutting implements, this one would make a great option. The blade itself is kind of a broad drop point made from CPM-154 particle steel. The flats sport a nice horizontal grain with nice contrasting grain direction on the ground portions of the blade. It also has a full length swedge, and because the drop starts about midway up the blade itself with the back half completely straight, there's some subtle but cool visual tension here. Of course, that relief on the spine will also be helpful in reducing drag when you're cutting through thicker materials. And the primary grind is flat and the edge itself is very thin, offsetting some of the thickness of the blade a little bit and helping it to cut more efficiently. So whether you're a collector, flipper, or a user, the Enrique Pena Signature Series Pena Song would make a phenomenal addition to your ballet song collection. They're a great value, not just as a high-end butterfly knife, but also as a more affordable Pena knife. To get your hands on one, click the link in the description below to head over to knifecenter.com.